It was a friend of mine who said, have you ever thought about the priesthood? My father was a non-practicing Catholic. My mother was a practicing Catholic. And I would summarize their whole reaction into one phrase, over my dead body. In 1970, there was nearly 60,000 priests in the United States. And in 2021, there were 35,000. So if there's a decline in the number of priests, then there's decline in the number of times and places where the Eucharist can be offered. There's a decline in marriages. There's a decline in the amount of children per family. And there's certainly a decline in people who go to Mass. Here's the crisis in the world. The crisis is being Christ-less. How's Christ going to continue in the world? By his holy priesthood. People's hearts and souls will be on the line. Somebody has to step up, and God has asked me to do it. What are we living for? Where are we going? It seems like it's the most difficult thing is to surrender my life to God, but it's the easiest thing because at the end of the day, He doesn't need every single part of it. He just wants our heart. I wanted to become a priest because of the experience that He has given me of being desired by Him who's perfect, me who's imperfect. The question for me, as was the question that Jesus you know, reflects upon in the gospel, in relationship to the man who accumulates all this wealth that God says, you fool, tonight your life will be demanded of you. So I asked the question of my congregation, I asked the question of myself, what is it that you want to hear from God at the end of your life? Well done, good and faithful servant, or you fool.